but I'm gonna do a little power hour for the next hour. Um, I've got some amazing pieces behind me. I've got ready to wear, I've got Max Mara, Chanel, Dior, I've got scarves, I've got bags, I've got lots of Nunas, and I've got um, some luxury hampers today for you guys. Um, I've got five available, which I'm sure they'll go very quickly. So I'm gonna be showing those, um, a little sneak peek of those as well. Um, I'm going live for the next hour. So hi everyone joining, hope you're having a nice Sunday. Um, so how it works if you're new to our live shows is I will show an item and it will pop up in the, um, an icon will pop up in the corner. All you have to do is click on that um, icon and then it will take you straight to the website where you can view more images, see more details and add it straight your cart as well um, we take many different payment options so we take um, all different types of cards paypal and split it as well so if you want to split your payment over like five six twelve months you can also do that um, it's a nice option if you don't want to pay like upfront for your item it means you can split it over a certain amount of um, time but i think i'm going to start i think i've covered everything customer duties are covered during duration of the live show um, so for the next hour, and we do ship worldwide. So it's £10 in the UK and £35 internationally. So all you have to pay for today is your item um, and custom duties covered and your shipping. So I'm going to begin. Um, I've got lots of ready to wear. I've got bags. I've got some jewellery and I've got hampers. So let me um, guys know what you want me to start with. Say hi in the comments if you're here. I know it's a Sunday. Most of you probably sleeping, having a lie in. But if you're here, say hello in the comments. And I'm going to begin. So I'm going to start with, I'm going to start with GST. So, we have an amazing, hi Becca, how are you? We have an amazing GST in beige caviar. We actually haven't had one in beige in a while. We have a, uh, get a lot of black in, like black with gold and silver hardware, but we haven't had beige one in in a while. So this is a new in piece. Um, it is the beige caviar version. Um, this is absolutely beautiful. As you know, these are really, really hard um, to get um, on the pre-loved market. Um, this one is actually in excellent, excellent condition. So it has the gold hardware. And it comes with its original dust bag. What else does it come with? And I'll check this series on this as well. This one's actually in really, really good condition. I would say this is like an 8, 9 out of 10. The inside is nice and clean. You have two nice compartments there and a zipping compartment in the center as well. This one's in really, really good condition. It's got gold hardware. And let me show you what it looks like over the shoulder. It's a really nice drop length um, to be worn on the shoulder as well. And I think you can fit, can you fit 13 inch laptops in here? You can. So you can fit a 13 inch laptop in here. So it's a perfect little work bag. This is what it looks like on the shoulder. And even like in the winter, if you had like um, a jacket on or a blazer, it would still fit over the um, shoulder comfortably. So this is what the drop length is like. I can do the measurements as well, but once the icon is up, you can see um, the dimensions over on the website. Hi Instagram, head over to our website now to watch our live show, it's pinned there in the comments. So yeah, condition eight, nine out of 10. Caviar, as you know, is super durable, so you won't get um, much signs of wear to this. There's only small little marks here to the base of the bag, um, but nothing too major. And we're selling this one for 2,200, which is a really great price. Um, that's 2,600 US dollars, and the icon is up now. There's more, yeah, that's a price in Zane Becker. Um, guys, you can't see me properly because I'm live over on the website, so head over there to watch. So yeah, the price is amazing, especially for the condition that this is in. Um, the gold hardware, there's literally no tarnish whatsoever. I'll show you corners again quickly. But if you want this, go grab it because customer duties are covered. That's what the corners look like. A really, really great everyday work bag. I like that it's beige as well. You see a lot of the black ones. And, um, this is actually the only beige caviar one we have in at the moment. So if you want it, grab it. Um, I'm going to show... I think I'm gonna do some ready to wear next. I might just do this blazer. I absolutely love this. So we have, so nice, right? We have a Max Mara wool checkered blazer. And this one's actually a really good size as well. I would say, I'll find the exact size. I feel like it's a size 38. Let me have a look. UK size 10. 10, yeah, perfect. So it's a size UK 10. Um, I can try this on for you to show you how it fits. Um, but it's like a full, I think it's wool. It feels like a wool, but like a lightweight wool, not too itchy or like heavy. Um, so it's a lovely checkered uh, grey. You've got dark and light grey throughout. And then you've got these lovely little buttons as well. Um, this is a really nice Max Mara um, blazer. I'm going to try it on for you. So it's a size 10. Any Chanel jewellery? Ooh, um, I have... Do I have Chanel jewellery? I have Dior jewellery. I've got Dior jewellery today. So this is what the blazer looks like on, I'm actually a size 10, so this is how it would fit exactly on a size 10, so it's a size 38. And this is what it looks like on me. 
I might actually leave this on. This is really, really comfortable. Really nice fit as well. It's got um slight shoulder pads. So you get like a little bit of a boxy shape, which is quite nice to have with blazers. I, I personally like that on a blazer. And then if I was to do it up, it would just look like this. Even done up, there's still like plenty of room. Um, and the price is so good. For a Max Mara wool blazer, this is £225, which is 266 US dollars. Let me turn around so you can see the back. It's quite a nice um, loose fit on me. Um, two pockets as well to the front. This is a really nice blazer. So this one is now available. The condition, by the way, is excellent. Um, bags, you want to see? Okay, I'll do the um, dual jewellery next. I've got some earrings. Um, so this is what the fit would be like. Comfortably does up as well, so it's a uh, UK 10 guys, so like a 38. So the icon is now up, you can see more details. I'll leave it on for now so you can see how it fits on me because it's actually my size. Um, but I'm going to move on and show the jewellery, but the icon is up, you can click there and shop that now. So, let me show the earrings. I have got some amazing Dior vintage clip-ons. So they come with a little box, not the original box, but still comes with the box to protect them and these are a beautiful dior clip-on earring i'm actually going to do a flip screen so you can see the details of these these really really remind me of chanel clip-ons to be honest they're very um elegant very timeless they're just like a little um gold clip-on situation i'll try them on for you as well let me show you the back so you've got the dior hope you can see that you've got the dior stamping there to the back and here we go. So definitely um, 24K gold plated. Um, Lucy, I do know the material. I, let me have a look. This one is. Yeah, it's a wool. It says here, it says. Yeah, it's pretty much like, it's 96 or something percent wool. So it's like lane wool. Um, yeah, it says cotton viscose. Um, so the outside I would definitely say. Okay, it's like it's like a lightweight wool so it's not like itchy or too heavy um so it's definitely like a, a wool blend but mostly yeah made out of wool um lucia so these are what the earrings look like in excellent condition there's no tarnish whatsoever like i said these are definitely 24k um plated so they look like this they have like a nice little abstract design these are great just everyday earrings like clip-ons even if you have pierced ears are just great because they, they're timeless they're more vintage looking they're elegant i absolutely love these they're a nice little size. The dimensions of these should be um, in the description. The icon is now up. Um, and the price is £250 for vintage short earrings, which I think is really good. Um, that's $295 US dollars. The icon is now up. You basically get like the look of Chanel clip-ons, but for a lot less. Um, so I think these are a great price for gold little clip-ons. So if you want those now, the icon is up. Hi, everyone joining. If you don't know how you um, shop, when I show an uh, item, the icon will pop up. Click on that icon and it'll take you straight to the website where you can see more um, details and images. Um, and you can also add it straight to your cart to purchase. And we do cover customer duties. Lady in Dior. Hi. Hi. Um, do you have any mini Lady Dior's? Mm, not on today's show. But I have got a Bobby. I've got a Bobby bag. And I've also got a Dior unboxing, which I'm actually going to move on to next. So I have got a little Dior unboxing today. This isn't a lady jewel, but hi Nadia, how are you? Um, I'm going to show you what's inside. So this one actually is a full set. And it's a little um, Dior Addict Black crossbody bag. This is so cute. So it's um, crafted with the canage black leather, which is super lovely. And it has like an antique, almost like brassy gold hardware, which is really, really nice. Um, sort of reminds me of like the wok, but a bigger version, which is nice, but super practical. Um, to the front, you've got the Dior, you've got this little like lock clasp, which is a really cute feature. I love the chain on these. It reminds me of like the Bijou chain a little bit. It's kind of got that effect and you've got like the CD stamping throughout all the links, which is really cool. And what I like about this is actually you can wear it as a shoulder bag as well as a crossbody. So I'll show you on the shoulder. It's got a really nice drop length and has a little um, key and clochette as well. Actually, this key's for the front lock part, but it looks really cute just over the shoulder. And then I can also, hi Sabrina, I can also show it to you over um, crossbody as well. Let me open it up for you. So to the inside, it's lined with black suede and you've got multiple compartments here, a zipper compartment and this one. And it's a full set, so this is a great gifting piece. Um, I would love to be gifted this or gift it to yourself. And then to the front, um, I can do a little flip screen show you. 
but to the front there's minimal tarnishing as you can see there's a tiny bit of scratching here to the where the lock is but in terms of the leather it's honestly so smooth there's no scratches as you can see it's that black canage leather which is amazing i love that from dual and even the hardware where it's like that antique gold there's like no tarnish it has that nice antique look to it and the price is insane for this dual Azic wallet on chain it is 850 pounds so literally a brand not brand new a full set bag for under 900 pounds so good that's 1005 us dollars the icon is now up let me show you it cross body quickly just so you can see what the drop length is so i'm like five foot three i'm quite sure but this is where it would sit on me so it's kind of just on like just sits just on the hip which is really nice so that's what it looks like on just mimics like the wallet on chain which i think is really nice but a little bit bigger It'd definitely fit a phone Let me just sort this out keeps moving so yeah it would comfortably fit um the largest iphone the newest one so you don't have to worry about that but yeah condition honestly eight out of ten apart from that tiny bit of scratching to the um front but the leather itself the overall body is in great condition and it's a full set so if you want that the icon is now up uh, and you can add that straight to your car and get customer duties covered yeah such a classic so next i'm gonna go for i'm gonna do you're gonna do more ready to wear i'm gonna show the chanel top this is so cute how amazing is this so it's like the striped cap sleeve scoop neck um chanel top with the cc to the front this is just such a like classic staple honestly chanel ready to wear especially anything that has like the cc to the front is such a timeless piece you can honestly like wear this in so many different ways you can wear it in the summer like as a little basic tee um or you can layer it under pieces like blazers in the winter would look so nice hi chrissy how are you um even in the winter you can layer this up it's a really nice um like it's a lightweight but also not too it's not like sheer or anything and the material is 100 percent cotton so it's 100 percent cotton material so it's nice and soft and it is a size is there a size in the description grace um, oh 40 guys it's a size 40 but i would definitely say this would fit um like anything between a size depending on how you want the fit i would say probably like an 8 to 12 I would definitely, do you think 8 to 12? I'd say oversize 6. Oversize 6. Yeah. It depends how you want it fitted. Like, if yeah. you want a looser fit or if you want it a bit more, um, like, tighter fitting, it really depends. But this would um, definitely fit, like, a size, um, like, oversize 6 to a 12, I would say. Um, so the price is £595. I have to say the condition of this is excellent. There's no pull, no snags, anything. And this cap sleeve is really flattering. So it's not just a short sleeve tee. It's like a cap sleeve, which I find very, very flattering personally. Um, that's 703 US dollars. The icon is up now, so you can see more details and images there. Um, but this scoop is really nice. And you've got that CC. I think striped tops are just great. And you've got like a black little lining to the bottom there as well. So this one is now available. The icon, um, oh Becky, you love everything. So the icon is now up, you can shop that now. And I'm gonna move on and show, maybe I'll do another bag. Let me do another Chanel bag. So we have this amazing Chanel paint and leather um, little camera bag. This is super, super cute. I, I personally love um, paint and I actually do like it when it's in like a smaller form like this. Um, I think it's very, very elegant. And this one has like the um, little tassel detail here with the CC, um, the 24K gold gilded. I'll try this on crossbody as well. But this is just a nice alternative to like a plastic flat or a wok. I personally love um, the vanity, uh, the camera bags with this patent. It's super, super nice. The condition of this one actually is really good as well. There's no like dolling at all to the paint and to the exterior. No dolling. No signs of wet, even the corners. I'll show you the corners. There we go. And then to the inside, this one comes with its original um, serial card and it is a um, one series. And let me show you the inside. Leather lining, which is nice so you can wipe it down if it gets dirty. But this one see, um, seems to be very clean inside. Very clean for inside. The zipper is fully functioning. I just love this tassel detail. I think it's really nice. And if you're not a fan, you can always tuck this in and have it like in when you wear the bag. I'll show it to you now, crossbow. I'm going to take this blazer off. It's getting a bit warm. This is a wool blazer, guys, so it's very nice and 
warm for the winter. If you guys are joining a little bit later as well, there is also a handbag icon down below. So anything I have already shown that isn't here in the icons will be down there in the handbag icon so you can recap anything I've shown or just check out new arrivals as well. Can the dual fit a phone? I'm tempted. Um, yes, definitely. Definitely, definitely, Chrissy. 100% fit the phone. Like I said um, earlier, this is large enough to fit the largest iPhone. So the newest like iPhone 14 Plus, I think it is. Um, that would comfortably fit inside. I'll show you the interior one more time as well. So it's a suede interior, but as you can see, I actually will give dimensions to you as well. I've got a measuring tape. So the dimensions of this is 24 centimeters, which is nine and a half inches. So it's nine and a half inches. Can you fit the screen on the hardware, please? Yes, of course I can. So. Hardware looks like this. I rated this bag 8 out of 10 just because the overall body, like the the leather of the bag, there's literally no wear at all. It's so shiny and super good condition. The only thing to point out is that tiny bit of scratching here to the padlock. It's basically where this has been like shut. But when it's shut, let me shut it. When it's shut like that, you can just see like a small bit of scratching for size. But where this hardware is like an antique gold, I think that adds to like the rustic look. Personally, I think it's fine. It's just a little bit of um, scratching there. And it does also come with that little key that I showed earlier here. So you can actually lock this, which means your bag will be um, super, your belongings will be nice and super safe. Julia, do you also mind wearing it? Um, do you want me to wear the blazer, Julia? I can put it back on for you to show. I think it's cuter than it. I think it's just different. It's something different to the Chanel um, walk. And it has got that like bijou chain like look with the CD. And guys, it does come with its full set like I showed before. It comes with its box, its dust bag. So it's a great gifting piece or gift it to yourself for Christmas. Why not? So that one is now available. Um, and then you wanted me to show, yes, Christy, let me show it this body. So this is what it looks like crossbody. On me, I'm five foot three, so it sits like just on my hip, which I think is a really nice um, length. Even with like a jacket or a coat on in the winter, this would sit um, still probably like just above my, um, like just on my waist. So it's a really nice length. This is what it looks like on Chrissy. Um, yeah, here you go guys. This is what it looks like crossbody. And then I'll also show it to you on the shoulder. Also really nice drop lamp on the shoulder. So you just move the chain and then on the shoulder, it looks like this. So it's still a really nice um, drop lamp. Again, even with the jacket on, this would um, fit comfortably on the shoulder. Yeah, I love this as well. So this is what that one looks like. It's a classic, honestly, it really is. Um, so let me try the jacket back on for you. So if you're joining late, this was a size um, UK 10 and I actually am a 10. So this is exactly how it would fit on me. Um, it's a grey checkered and it's um, a wool cotton blend, but definitely more on the um, more percentage of wool because it, it does feel like wool. But it's like a lightweight one, um, so it's not too heavy. It's got slight shoulder pads as well, which I, I like personally. I think it gives a nice boxy shape and you can obviously do it up. It's got two buttons to the front and two pockets. So if I was to do it up, it would fit still kind of like on the tiny bit of the looser side. Um, so I think this is nice for layering in the winter. Got buttons here on the sleeves as well. So this is what the fit looks like and it is repinned there. So you can click on that icon to see more images, but I'll leave this on for a bit just so you can get an idea of what it looks like. Um, I'm now gonna show, did I reveal the price? Oh, I didn't, right, the camera bag. The camera bag price, it's 2,695 pounds, um, which is 3,187 US dollars. It's a one series, guys. So it's from 1989 to 91, and it comes with its card and its dust bag. This is a really, really special piece, honestly. You've got that 24K gold gilding um, with the painting and that little tassel detail as well. I'll show it across body for you. So this one sits a little bit higher up. I said I'm short, but it sits like um, on my waist. So this is where it would sit on me. But I think this is lovely. Um, hi, Charlotte, how are you? And let me show you the condition again. No scratches to the corners, so no scuffing and no dulling to that painting at all. So it's still super nice and shiny. You could even like wear this as a little clutch. These um, camera bags are really, really um, practical. You could tuck in the chain and the tassel and have this as, like, as a little clutch for the evening. I think it's just great. So the icon is there, it's in the middle. You can tap on that. And I'm gonna do a small leather good. So I'm gonna do an LV. Um, 
something so um, I'm gonna do this little LV cosmetic pouch um, so this is crafted with the um, coated canvas monogram which is nice and durable and this is a nice little size I can do the measurements on this as well but this one actually does have a um, oh the one on chain and um, your one on chain sold guys congratulations let me know who got that we'll get that shipped off to you oh Chrissy you missed it it wasn't you guys who got it let me know in the comments if you want to let me know but congratulations so we'll go back to the LV um this one's actually in really good condition and like I was saying it does have this little loop so you can attach um like a keychain you could attach um a chain and wear it like crossbody you could do so many things with this honestly or attach it to the, your bag so you can put it inside your bag with like a keychain you won't lose it has a fully functioning zipper and then to the inside um just to point out there is um sometimes with these little toiletry pouches the leather on the inside does start to crack like this you can see but this one honestly i've seen ones in a lot worse um, condition with like where it flakes off but this one seems to be okay there's just a little bit of cracking to the inside um which oh claudia did you get it congratulations oh it's your first year that's a great first year honestly a great piece to have as your first year um so the condition is so good just apart from that inside the exterior though is in good condition just because the inside i rate this like a seven out of ten um but the price is great it's 250 um for this little accessory pouch and these are also great gifting pieces um they're unisex pieces so anyone can have these you can use them for like you can put your passport in there and use it when you go traveling. You can put your cards, um, keys, like honestly, makeup, anything. So these are great just to have to pop in your bag. A really great gifting piece as well for Christmas coming up, guys. Um, and it does have that extra little hook, which I don't actually, you don't always see on these little um, pouches. So that's a good little feature. Yeah, exactly. Keep your stuff organized and pop this in your bag. So this one is now available. The icon is up and... Hi, Instagram, you have to head over to our website to watch. That's why you probably can't see me. It's pinned in the comments there. So head over to our website now um, to watch the live show. So this one's now available. Guys, I do actually, you can probably see in the background, I do have five luxury hampers available today. They are the smaller Hermes ones. Um, so I will be doing those later on in the show. I've got like, I think about half an hour or so, just over half an hour left. So I'll be doing the hampers later on in the show. But if you guys... Want one? Um, do let me know in the comments because we will reveal it. I uh, will reveal like five of them later, and I'll maybe do a little sneak peek of what is inside as well. Yeah, someone honestly has to get this blazer for the price, like Max Mara. I don't know how much they're based on now, but probably like in the five hundreds, maybe four hundreds. This is like two hundred and something, I believe. Can I see the black jumper? Yeah, I'm gonna show that next. Um, is it this one? How can you even see that, Chrissy? Is it this one you're talking about? I have got something black there as well, but it's not a jumper. It's an LV um, scarf. I can show that as well. So, this is actually a vintage. Oh my God, £875. Jeez. Okay, guys, so these in um, store are like £875. We're selling this for, I think it was under £300, right? Okay. Under £300 for a wool blazer that's in honestly excellent condition in a size 10. You guys need this. Someone honestly needs this because it's such a good price. So I have got another piece of ready to wear. This is a vintage YSL jumper. I honestly love this. It's in like a, um, a dark navy blue, which is really nice and wearable. And then to the front, if you can see here, it says love. And then to the bottom, it says um, Yves Saint Laurent in this like lighter cobalt blue color in this scripting. I'm going to turn it around just to see because it's the wrong way around. So if you can see that. That's what it looks like to the front. It has like this gold iridescent writing where it says love. And then you have Yves Saint Laurent below as well. Um, Echo, I would say it's a true 10. So let me just show you. I'm a 10. So I'm a true 10. And this jacket is um, obviously a size 10 as well. This is how it fits on me, which is personally how I like my blazers to fit. I like them to be a little bit more oversized. It's not like a fitted, fitted one. So as you can see, there is still room on me. Even if I did up the button, there is obviously still room as well. Um, but yeah, I would say it's a true 10, but it's a looser fit. It's not like a tailored, um, slim fit jacket. It's definitely a looser fit. So that's what it looks like on me. But yeah, I would say a true 10. Um, Max Mara quality is insane as well, yeah. Um, so this is what the jumper looks like. And this one is a size... Let me check. Don't think it would fit you. Uh, what size are you, Echo? 
this one says it's a size medium but i think this is in japanese um sizing i can't actually read the composition either because it's in japanese um but i feel like this one would be like a size 10 like an oversized fit on a size 10 um you're a size 12 um Eka, i'm not to be honest i'm not sure because it is like i said it is a looser fit like i, I am a size 10 and it, there is a lot of room on me like you can see even with the jacket like where it hangs there is a looser fit and even when i do the button up there's still like plenty of room here this will go to the i think it will go to a 12 echo echo i do think it will fit you because there is like loose on me and i'm a size a true size 10 so I, I do think it will fit you and if it doesn't you can always return it any ready clear that you guys buy on the show you can return um so yeah echo i do think it will fit you 100 percent. it's a very loose fit i don't feel constricted or tight in it at all um, so going back to this jumper, it's a size medium, but I would say probably like a UK, anything again from like, it really depends on how you guys like your stuff fitted, but I would honestly say anything from like above, like over a size six to a size 12, depending on how you want it fitted. On me, this would probably be like um, a bit of a looser fit again. So like, I personally like my jumpers like this again, but it's all down to preference. I like them to fit like a little bit more oversized. I think it's just cozy and nice for the winter. Um, this one, I love that it's in navy as well. And it's not just like black. I love just the writing of the Saint Laurent on the front with that cobalt blue. I think it's so nice. Um, so the price of this one is £695 for a vintage YSL um, oversized jumper. And that is $822. US You can see the um, tag on the inside as well. Yeah, it's definitely roomy, Chrissy. Depends how you like your fit, Echo. Um, but this one is now available. And there's no pull or snags to the um, material whatsoever. It's in really good condition. And I think this is great. So the icon is up. You can shop that now. And I'm going to show. I'm going to probably going to do. Let me do a pair of sunglasses. So I have got these amazing Dior sunglasses. These are absolutely insane. I actually wanted to get these for myself. Um, they're so, so nice. They remind me of like the Chanel um, Rimless style sunglasses, but these are Dior. So I know these are going to be a good price. So if you can see these annoying that the tags on the i might have to rip that off to show you guys so i can try them on for you um but these are a great gifting piece so, this is what they look like no scratches to the lens and as you can see let me do a flip screen. if you can see on the inside there you've got these little star details which i think is really cute so you've got dior to the center and then you've got these like four stars on either side which i think is really cute there we go. No scratches to the lens whatsoever. They're like a light brown um, lens. And then to the side as well. Oh, it's not focusing. To the side as well. You've got Dior there on the arm and more stars. I'll try these on for you. But again, these are a great gifting piece for Christmas coming up. This is what they look like on. I absolutely love these. These are insane. So they remind me of the Chanel um, Rimless 90 sunglasses, like I was saying, but definitely for a fraction of the price. Um, so get the price up of these, but these are honestly insane condition. They'll come with a luxurious dust bag as well to protect them. Um, but these are literally £195. An insane price. £195, which are US dollars I feel like this type of style honestly suits um, every face shape. There's just something really flattering about the, the Rimless style. And these are more like a, a slim lens as well. But these are a really, really great gifting piece. Can we see the black scarf too? Yeah, I'll show that next echo. So the icon is now up, but for these vintage your sunglasses under £200, these are just great. So there we go. Okay, I'm going to show the scarf next. So I think it's actually the only like wintery scarf we have in at the moment. So if you guys are looking for one, yeah, they remind me of early 2000s as well, Ali. They're so nice. We have an LV um, wool knitted scarf this is so lovely it's black which obviously means it's been worn with absolutely everything definitely jlo vibes um and the composition of this is actually 100 percent cashmere it's not wool sorry it's cashmere i did think it felt really really soft yeah let me give it to you it is a g c one three one three so it is 100 percent cashmere and it has also got like this little leather tag detailing here with um, the LV logo. And I think it also has it on another side as well. 
Oh no, it doesn't. Just that side. So it has an LV logo um, leather detail there. Let me try it on for you. This is 100% cashmere. It's really, really nice and cozy. It's a thick one as well. So you can see that LV um, little um, leather tab there as well when you wear it this way. Um, oh, the blazer sold. Congratulations. Let me know if you got the blazer. Was it you, Echo? Um, congrats, nevertheless. I will take it off in a minute. Um, so this is what it looks like on. Really nice and cozy. Obviously, you can wear it like this or you can wrap it round like an actual scarf. But everyone needs like a black scarf in their collection for winter. This is obviously cashmere as well, so it's great, great um, quality. And it's £250. £250 for 100% cashmere is amazing, considering like in M&S you literally pay like hundreds for cashmere. Um, this is an LV scarf, guys. And it has like got that mimicking of um, the Damier print. If you can see, it's like checkered. So it kind of mimics that. It's not just like a plain black one. It has got like texturized to it. Oh, Echo, was it not you? Congratulations, um, either, either way. But here you go. Great condition, no snags or pull to the uh, material whatsoever. This one, already. Guys, sold. I told you it's sold. This is only the only scarf, like thick scarf we have in at the moment. We'll definitely get more in. So congratulations to whoever got this. And take the laser off as well. Um, and I'll move on. Maybe I'll do some hampers in a minute as well. So. Let me move on and show another ready to piece. I'm gonna show this dual um, jumper, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. This is insane, honestly. It's a V-neck um, fitted jumper, and it's in this beautiful, like, true stone creamy beige color. Um, and as you can see, it's got the Dior um, oblique, like, print throughout the whole jumper. This is so cute. Oh, Tez, you got it, congratulations. So how insane is this? This is like very preppy looking, very cool. I love that it's a V-neck actually. Um, I think it's great. This is honestly so cute. You usually see this like dual oblique all over bags. I've actually never seen it in a piece of um, ready to wear, like a jumper like this. And this is like a neutral color as well. Like we have, um, the, I think we had the dual oblique top, but it was like the pink one, the little tank top. But this is great for winter coming up. This will keep you so nice and warm. And this one is a size medium. So it's a size medium, but I would definitely say this is like a size eight to 10. And I don't know the composition of this one, but it definitely feels like wool, like it's thick. Cashmere. Cashmere. It's cashmere. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, it's cashmere. So it's actually cashmere, but it's very nice and thick. This will definitely keep you warm for sure. Size medium, but I would definitely say, like I said, eight to 10. It would definitely be like a more fitted style. Very preppy. This would look amazing with, um, like a white shirt underneath the collar coming through and you've got that v-neck is so nice and it's a full length one as well this is what it would look like on me and the price is good so 595 pounds for a dior like oblique beige sweater with dior all over um and that is 703 us dollars an insane price and yeah the condition is excellent 100 percent cashmere keeps you so nice and warm condition is excellent there's no marks no stains whatsoever in that beautiful beige color which obviously will go with absolutely everything got like the ribbing detail here to the um arms and to the top and bottom as well i think i might have just sold check so sold, sold. i knew that would sell quickly that one's sold already guys i've only got um two pieces ready to wear left in today's show and a little chanel beanie which i'm actually going to um show next so that one has just sold congratulations to whoever got that one I knew that would sell quickly. And we've still got, I'm gonna put them here so you can see them, the YSL jumper as well as the Chanel top available. So there's that back there if you want me to recap them. If you want me to recap anything, do let me know. I have um, like about 25 minutes left. If you want me to recap anything before I go, do let me know. There is a Chanel beanie on today, so I'm gonna show it next. So I don't know if this is actually, it's, it's like a, it is a beanie star, I will try it on. Um, but it's very different. So basically, obviously it's got the CC to the front. It's so cute. Excuse me? ASL. 4, 4, 8, 7. So how cute is this? So I absolutely love this. You guys were asking for, it's on your show, isn't it? People yes. were asking for Chanel beanies. And I have to say, this is the only one we have. This is literally yeah. the only Chanel beanie we have um, ever, anywhere. So if you want this, do you grab it now, so I'm sure this will go quickly. Has got the CC to the front, which I love. I love that large CC detail. If you don't, you can obviously wear it that way and have that to the back. 
it's really up to you but i personally wear this at the front because obviously it's chanel so you may as well show it um and then to the bottom is this like lovely thick wool and this does fully go like down but obviously you roll it up to wear it i'm going to show it on and then like the material that's at the front is um this top part sorry it's like um it's like a canvasy almost feels a bit like nylon-y yeah like nylon type of canvas and obviously that cc plaque so this is a cream um like off-white color to the top and then this is like a mixture of like beiges and creamy colors which is really really nice so this actually is um 100 wool on the outside um, on this part sorry and then obviously this is like a polyester bend um and this is actually a size medium so i'm gonna try it on for you see what this looks like on i'm gonna have very bad hat hair in a minute so oh this is so cute this is what it would look like on so a cute little beanie i don't know i don't know what um how you measure heads this is so nice I absolutely mediums, mediums are perfect size for i'd say everyone do you think yeah. yeah it seems like there's a lot of room in this honestly i actually i'm obsessed with it i want this um so this is what it would look like i can't hear it's like blocking my ears this would definitely keep you warm because you know when your ears are exposed in the winter and it's cold these are completely covering my ears i can barely even hear anything i can hear myself even talk um so this is 695 pounds which is 822 us dollars um it's a great neutral white cream and beige you can't go wrong with this i think this is super cute for winter i love this but yeah from 2000s and this is the only Chanel beanie we have, guys. So if you want it, go and grab it. It's a great neutral. You know this will go with absolute everything. And honestly, get your Chrissy. Thank you. No more Chanel beanies. This is the only one we have available, guys. This is the only one we have in the whole of LP. So if you want it, do go and grab it now. Condition is excellent. No marks whatsoever to that. Um, it's either the materials. And can I show the lining as well? Because look at that. It's like a fleecy lining. A really really nice fleecy lining to the inside so your head is gonna also I can't tell you how warm this is it's gonna keep you extremely extremely warm in the winter so that one's now available the icon is up you can see um, more images there but yeah condition nine out of ten so that one's available and oh, what am I gonna show next should I show some Celine I'm gonna do this little Celine shoulder bag this is super cute so we have like barely any Celine left because I know how much you guys um, love Celine. It's selling like super quickly. I think this is not like this is one of the only pieces we have left with the Triumph um, like print all over. And this is a vintage piece. It's a little shoulder bag, but it does open up. And then to the inside, you have two um, free compartments, even two on either side. And in the middle, you've got a zipper compartment, too. Um, so to the front, you've got the Celine Paris logo. Um, is there a hamper? Jojo, that. There is. I've got five hampers available on today's show. I'm actually going to probably do that next, to be honest, because um, I have to end the show in like 20 minutes. So I've got five hampers, and they are the Hermes um, smaller version, so the 750 version. And I might do a little sneak peek of what's inside this one, um, if anyone wants that one um, in particular. Um, so this is the Celine shoulder bag. Let me show you it on. I love how um, like tans these leather handles are, all the trimming. It's a really nice, like, true tan, almost like a gold um, from Hermes colour. And then this is what it looks like popped on the shoulder. A lovely, like, coated canvas. And then, as you can see, it's got this trimming detail all to the bottom, which is really nice. Honestly, an insane price. Under £500 for vintage Celine is so good. That's £495, which is $585. US dollars. Okay, Lucia says an M should be a size 57 to 58. I think that's, like, circumference, right? You're manifesting a VS hamper. Oh, probably have some coming soon, Jojo. Don't worry. Um, so this is what the trimming looks like. Nowhere to the canvas at all. Nowhere to the corners. There's a tiny bit of um, like, not wear, but like to the to the leather part at the front here, the Celine. But I think it really adds to the look. It's that like tan, beautiful color. Fits perfectly on the shoulder, and the icon is now up. So the icon is now up, guys. Um, we did actually, on Friday, we did actually have some with VCA and Cartier in. I don't know if you watched our show with um, Sabrina, but we did have some with VCA and Cartier. So obviously it's a mystery hamper, guys. So you don't know what you're going to get inside. I might do a little sneak peek of what, what's inside. One of the items that's inside this hamper behind me today. Um, apart from that, it's a mystery. So you don't know what you're going to get inside. That's the, the, the whole um, point of it. But this is what it looks like. Condition is honestly 
Seven, eight out of ten. So that one is now available. Do you guys want us to do hampers next? Should we do all five at the same time? Or should we just, yeah? Yes. Let's do all five at the same time. I'll so, five on your okay, amazing. Guys, these are going to be alive on new arrivals. We can get um, one pinned up here and then they're all going to be available. Um, oh, circumference, yeah. So, but medium's a good size. I feel like it'll fit a lot of um, head sizes. And that, that beanie is also quite stretchy. So it's actually quite stretchy. Will fit like a lot of head sizes, I feel like. So let's do some hampers. And if you guys aren't familiar with hampers, it's something we recently introduced um, for Christmas coming up. I think it's a great gifting idea for like yourself or for family members. And it's nice because it's a mystery. So basically, um, this one I have here today, we have three different versions. The other two aren't available on today's show. I'm waiting for the delivery of my Hermes hamper I ordered last week. Oh, you got one already, Jojo. Did you get the large one or the small one? So this is the smaller version that I have available here today. Let me show you like the size of it. I'm not going to show what's inside. I'm going to just sneak peek of one item that's inside, which actually is a Chanel item. Um, so you could honestly get anything in these, like up to a Chanel bag. You might get a gold ticket inside one of yours as well. So it's um, super exciting. You've got a small one. So this is a small one. So Jojo got one of these. But you guys, I'm going to make five available. So someone can grab, five people can grab these today. We do have a limited amount of them because um, we obviously have to make them. And yeah, here you go. So this is what the hamper looks like. And this one is the £750 one. Um, but the contents of what's inside will be up to, I think these ones are 1500 yeah. yeah, so the contents of what's inside would be up to 1,500. Oh, Nadia, you ordered one last night as well. Okay, so whatever's inside here will be up to 1,000, over 1,500 pounds, guys. So I'm not going to reveal what's inside. I might do, if someone wants it, do let me know in the comments, and I will do a sneak peek of what's inside one of them. Um, any other Celine? Susan, I don't have any other Celine on today's show. Just that one. I have more LV. And how many pieces do I have left? I think I just have two, three pieces left to show you. I've got 15 minutes left. Guys, go to the new arrivals page right now. I'm gonna pin three. Okay, amazing. So I've got five available. Grace has pins free here. So if you want them, honestly, click on these. There's no image. Click on that icon. Click on any of these icons right now. And it'll take you straight to the website where you can purchase one. Um, and whoever purchases this one here, which is... ASL 5266. I'm going to show you one item as a surprise of what's inside. So anyone that gets ASL 5266, I'm going to show you a sneak peek and it is a little Chanel box. Um, and I'm going to do the unboxing of the big Chanel box right now. Um, yeah, everything else is a surprise. There's numerous items in there. I'm not going to show you everything, but I will show you one item. So if you want them, go grab them now. The icons are up and go on to new arrivals. Um, so I'm gonna move on and show a little unboxing of the Chanel box. Um, so what's in here is really cool. Can you show the YSL bag again? Um, I didn't have a YSL bag. I had a YSL jumper. I can show that. So I'll buy this so we can see. Yeah, honestly, um, what's in there is really exciting, I have to say. Um, I'm gonna show, I don't know if you're talking about the YSL jumper, Tash. I didn't have a bag, but I have this jumper. So this is a vintage YSL jumper in navy. Has the Yves Saint Laurent um, cayenne. And yeah, cayenne the vouchers didn't work. Who should I reach out to? Oh, okay. So we had a few people saying that the vouchers didn't work. Um, we will look into that. Um, and it was meant to be a Fendi one. Did anyone do a Fendi one? No, our mystery boxes are a mix. Oh, guys, our mystery boxes are a mix. So they're not specifically any brand. Um, is there three hampers or is it one? There's five hampers available. T, there's five hampers available just today. So it's a limited amount. I only have five today on today's show. So if you want one, all of these icons, actually the hampers or head to new arrivals, click on the icon and it'll take you straight to the new arrivals page where you can purchase it. And whoever purchases ASL 5266 hamper, I will show you a sneak peek from behind me. I'm going to show you a sneak peek. Yeah, the boxes aren't any specific brand. Um, Tash. What did you think you saw? Um, Tash, what is it you thought you saw? Gold YSL bag? Uh, I don't have any gold. I just have a Celine. Um, but this YSL jumper is the only YSL thing I have in today's show. So this one also is available. If you guys um, are joining later, I have only like 10 minutes left. But if you want anything, check the handbag icon down below. And anything I've already shown um, will be in there for you to recap. Pretty much all I already wear has sold apart from this Chanel top and um, this jumper. 
yeah, is it the Celine bag you're thinking about? Tash, that you saw. Um, guys, the hampers are up. All of these icons are the hampers. I only have five available, and they are the 750 ones, and the value will be um, over 1,500 what's inside. So it's a surprise. Um, let me come and show you what's in the Chanel. I have got a little Chanel unboxing, and this is a super cute little shoulder bag. Um, Hannah, I'm going to look into that for you. How cute is this Chanel little canvas? And this is a really, really great price. This is a little um, Chanel shoulder bag. This is so, so cute. It's black, it's silver hardware. I've never seen anything like quite like this. This is a true vintage piece. Um, so this did come from one of our customers. I bought this in, she said it was her first ever Chanel bag, which is really cute. Um, and this is a really, really great price. Um, so as you can see, it kind of reminds you of like the little LV pochettes, but Chanel version. And it's black, so it's very wearable. You've got that CC detail as well here. And then the chain is nice and thick. It's got this intertwined detail, which is really lovely. Um, and even the chain itself is canvas with this um, silver hardware. It's, it's also a darker silver. It's actually gunmetal, sorry. It's a gunmetal hardware. Um, so this is a great little shoulder bag. And they've got like these little ribbing detail as well to each corner, which means it'll be super durable. Um, I'll show you the inside as well. It pops open for like a pop lock closure. And then to the inside, it's lined with like Chanel um, monogram canvas to the inside. And this will definitely fit a large iPhone as well. So this will definitely fit the um, iPhone 14 plus. And this comes with its full set. So it comes with its dust bag and the box as well. Um, and the condition. It's great. As you can see, it's canvas, which means it'll be nice and durable and wearable. Um, and there's no marks at all to the canvas. I doubt this person even wore this like a lot at all because it comes with its full set. And I think she said she literally left it in her box for like so many years. So it's in great condition, honestly, nine out of 10. Um, a really cute little shoulder bag. And this will fit um, perfectly even over jackets and stuff in the winter. It's a nice drop length. And a great gifting piece as well. And the price is 1350 which is 1596 US dollars. So a great price for a Chanel bag. Literally a Chanel bag under one five is just insane. And I love that's a little shoulder bag as well. A little pochette. So cute. So that one's now available. The icon is up. Guys, the hampers are still available. So click on the icons and go to the new arrivals page. There's five available and they're the 750 ones. Um, so many hampers we get mixed up. Yeah, we have three different version, versions of hampers, guys. Um, so the ones today are just the Hermes ones, um, not the LP ones. Um, no, your code. Yeah, I do think they, I do think they come with vouchers, but um, for some reason... I don't think they all do. I don't if, you think... get, if you get more than one leather good or one pair of earrings, they yeah. don't come with vouchers. Guys, it's they're basically... Yeah, they're complete surprise boxes. They're mystery, so you don't actually know... Oh, they're so saying they all come with vouchers. Okay. They all come with vouchers. Okay, so Sabrina's here. She's clarified that. They all come with vouchers. Um, but obviously what's inside them is a mystery. The only one that I'll be unboxing today, if someone gets um, this one, I'll show one item that's inside of there. Um, yeah, we had an issue with some of your vouchers not working, but we'll look into that. Um, I have two items left on today's show, and I've got like 10 minutes left. So let me show this um, Dior Bobby bag. This is so timeless and elegant. Honestly, I absolutely love this. It's crafted like a smooth calfskin leather. So nice. It's got gold hardware. What's the difference with the Hermes box versus the LP box? Um, so the Hermes boxes are our luxury hampers. I've got one here as an example today. Um, so this is the smaller version of the, this is the small version, which is 750. So this is the small Hermes luxury hamper. And we also have, um, other ones the bigger ones which aren't available on today's show but i have five of these available on today's show so this is the hermes one and this in particular one is 750 um, maureen and what's inside is obviously a mystery but it will be anything over up to like over a thousand five hundred pounds um so as you can see your little sneak peek you've got hermes you've got chanel and then some of you who purchase you might even get a golden ticket inside which means you might even get a chanel bag um so it's very exciting um, and then the LP ones are 395, I believe, but we don't have any available on today's show. They're basically a smaller version and it'll be like anything up to like, I think it's 700, 800 pounds. Um, so let me show this one. Hope that clarifies. But the ones that are available, the five that are available, if you click on these icons here with no images, um, or go to new arrivals, those are the ones that I've available on today's show. Um, so back to this Bobby bag. 
yeah no more 395 lasso they're limited guys the, the stuff we have is limited um bridget head over to our website um that's pinned if you want to see anything that i'm showing um so this is the bobby bag this is an excellent excellent condition um this also does come with its strap which is um super practical you don't have to use the strap if you don't want it you can wear it as a clutch because it is completely detachable um but it also is adjustable here so you've got the christian dual here and it's got um three different holes so you can adjust it um to whichever um emmy we're gonna do the dual bobby now so i'll reveal the price in a minute We've got the CD to the front. The price is actually £2,095, um, which is US dollars A really great price, obviously selling these for less than retail. To the inside, you've got that suede lining, and this obviously will comfortably fit a larger iPhone as well. So the icon is now up. And this is what it looks like over the shoulder. A really nice drop peg. Very classy and elegant and timeless. This is what it will look like. The leather is super, super smooth. No scratches whatsoever. As you can see, no scratching. Can't fault this bag at all. I would honestly say this one is like a 9 out of 10. Um, I don't think this will go crossbody though. Because um, it is on its um, longest setting right now. So it's just like a little shoulder bag. But like I said, the um, strap is completely detachable. So if you wanted, you could get um, a longer strap or a chain and also wear it crossbody. Um, I think you can actually, you can also wear these as a bum bag. So you can also wear it as a waist belt bag, which I think is a really, really nice um, idea as well. Um, so £2,095. And we do come custom duties during duration of the live show. I'm going to be live for like literally the next six minutes. So if you guys want me to recap anything, do let me know in the comments um, below. If not, I'm going to head off. But I've got one item left to show. Um, and then I'm going to head off. So this is this one, available, 9 out of 10 condition, and it will come with um, its original dust bag. So the last item I'm going to show on today's show is a Louis Vuitton travel bag. So this is an LV55 bandelier travel bag. Um, this one's honestly in such good condition, like almost brand new condition. I'd rate this like a um, 9 out of 10. Oh, thank you, Tasha. I got them done yesterday. Um, so this one's crafted with the LV monogram canvas, the coated canvas, um, and even the leather trimming on these. There's literally, as you can see, no darling or patina at all to the um, leather. It's got the little luggage tag with LV. And I do like the bandoliers a lot because they do also come with the um, strap. So it comes with the fully detachable and adjustable strap. You've got numerous different holes. You've got a comfort pad here to the top. And you can wear it over the shoulder if you're traveling. Obviously, it's a 55 size, so it's a large size. Um, but this is obviously great for, like, if you're going away for the week or something. Or just, like, a weekend trip. Depends how heavy or light you pack. Um, so this is the condition of it. Let me show you the corners. Honestly, no, no like, signs of where to point out at all. There we go. Got the LV, and the price is one thousand two hundred and fifty pounds, which is one thousand four hundred and seventy-eight US dollars. Honestly, such a great price for a um, travel bag that's of this size. It's the fifty-five, and the condition is just insane. So, the icon is up. You can see more details and images. Way under retail, yeah, in excellent condition. Honestly, this almost looks like brand new, and the size is just great. And obviously, if you were to get like the, um, the normal LV, like larger speeds without the bandolier and um, the strap, it's obviously less practical because you can't like pop it over your shoulder or wear it crossbody if it's heavy and you're carrying a lot of stuff. Um, yeah, you would be paying, like Grace said, nearly 2K in the store. So this is a great price for this. And we are covering customer duties. All you have to pay is shipping, guys. So it's £10 in the UK and um, 35 internationally. So let me know if you want to recap anything. If not, I'm probably going to head off. We have also still got the mystery boxes available. Um, yeah, it's a great weekend bag, Jojo, you're right. Um, if you want to recap anything, what we've got available. So the Chanel GFT. And this one is still available. This is actually the only beige cabbie one we have available, guys. We only ever have the black ones. We rarely ever get the beige ones in. And this one's just in excellent condition. So this one's still available. If you want this, it will be on the new arrivals page. All this stuff will still be on the new arrivals page. Available for you to shop. Let's show what's inside the box behind you. Should you do it? Okay. I'm going to show you what's inside. So no one has purchased this one yet. But I'm going to show you a sneak peek of what you could be in for if you did purchase this. Um, so this hamper, guys, these are all available. 
750 pounds. You get a mystery of what's inside. They're Hermes. But I have got one Chanel item this one, which I'm going to show. So the, all the ones I actually um, did put up today. No, oh, don't. Right. Oh, okay. I won't. No. I'm not going to do it, guys. Unless someone purchases it, I'm not going to show what's inside then. Um, do you have the strap? Kinga. Um, for this. Okay, I'm not going to show. Someone should buy it and trust. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to show what's inside then. Um, <laughs> I'm not going to show what's inside, but just know it's something really... Okay, don't. Everyone's saying don't. Okay, so I'm not going to show what's inside, but what's inside is very good. So if you guys want these, honestly, they're a great item to get. Like, just as a mystery for a Christmas present. Can't you say if it's vintage or... Can you say... Mm, I'm not... I'm not going to give out any hints, guys. So if any of you want it, it's available. And we do have five on the website. A mix of new and vintage. So wh whatever you get in there is a complete mystery. So, yeah. Those ones, these ones are um, box fresh. The ones I'm showing today, the Hermes ones, are box fresh. Um, maybe you can just show the boxes. I mean, you can kind of see, guys, to be honest. It's like overspilling. So as you can see, what the value inside is over 1,500. So as you can see, like, I'll show you the size for reference this is the smaller version there's quite a lot of stuff in there so as you can see if you want it go and grab it um someone asked if it comes with the strap this does come with the strap it's the bandolier so it comes with this um detachable and adjustable strap which number is that one susan this one is asl 5266 so susan if you purchase it on the night in the next couple of minutes trust the process Okay, so Grace has put the um, SKU. You can type it in on the website or you go to the new arrivals and you see the one that's ASL 5266. I will give you a sneak peek, Susan, if you get it, of one item that's inside your box. You can find all five available on new arrivals, guys. Um, so whoever asked the strap, it does come with it and the comfort strap at the top as well. It's a mystery. But for some reason, you guys like, it's a mystery box, but a lot of you guys ask and see what's inside of them. Um, so it's up to you really if you want to add a mystery or you, if you want to see what's inside. All of them are up. So this one's still available. There's, um, this is still available, guys. CC top, striped. I've got two pieces of ready to wear left. The rest of it's sold today. Um, so any corner wear. Kinga, um, not at all. This one's actually in a nine out of 10 condition. No corner to wear whatsoever. Like, let me show you. There we go. No corner wear. Even the um, no patina to the leather trimming. Literally nothing. I can't fault this bag whatsoever. No, that's in condition, Kinga. There we go. Guys, I'm going to end the show in literally the next couple of minutes. Let me know if you want to recap anything before I do head off. Because Singapore is going live now for the next couple of hours. There we go. King, our custom duties only come for the next couple of minutes, so if you want it, go grab it. We also have got the um, little pouch available still. Kayon, you got it. What did you get? This one? Yeah, one of the boxes. Oh, one of the boxes. Mm -hmm. Kayan, so did you get this box? Is it this one in particular? If it's not, then I'm not going to show what's inside. Mystery box. Four more left. Okay, one box is sold. Four more or less. Head over to our new arrivals to um, grab one of those now because they are limited. There's only five, four left now. Um, Kyan, tried to purchase that one. Sold already. Oh, oh okay, Susan, tried to purchase it. Um, Kinga, go grab that now quickly. I'm going to leave you a couple minutes. Just go grab that. Um, the icon is there. Add it straight to your car. I've got the one you have. Okay, so Kyan, you got ASL 5266? Kyan, if you got this, okay. So, do you want me to show what's in this little Chanel box, Kyan? Let me know, or do you want it as a mystery? When do you say the next show is? Um, bags, it's literally straight after me, so stay on um, the website, because Singapore is going to go live as soon as I finish, so just stay on on here. Um, Kyan, do let me know. If not, we'll get the ships off to you, and it'll be a complete mystery. If not, I can show you what's in this little Chanel box as a sneak peek. Not the whole box, but just this one let me know and Kinga let me know if you have any problem is it saying not available um it should be available Kinga it hasn't sold so maybe we're okay Kyan I'm gonna show what's inside this box I'm gonna end the show with this 
Um, Kinga, it is still available, it hasn't sold, so just refresh the page maybe um, and try it your cart. Sometimes it um, does that as a little blip, but it should still be available. So Kyan, congratulations on your mystery box. I'm gonna show one item. So guys, this is what you could be in for if you get the mystery boxes. Like I said, they're valued over 1,500. Um, and you're only paying 750. So, Kyan, what you get in this little Chanel is actually a brand new box fresh little beige card holder. How cute is this? So, Kyan, you did get the one that was behind me, and I did promise that I would show. So, you have got this little beige Chanel brand new card holder inside. I just want to see what what's inside <laughs> yeah Kyan, how insane is this guys this is brand new box fresh literally seal salon comes with everything how amazing is this beige lambskin i could hold not buying mystery yeah so this is what it looks like and this is now yours so congratulations guys this is what you're in for if you do get the mystery boxes so if you want them there is four still available it's absolutely insane you never know what you're going to get. You could get a gold ticket and you could get a Chanel bag. So you never know. Um, so if you guys want them, you want BCA and Cartier too. Well, it's a mystery, Kyan. So you never know. Um, I have a Chanel that costs me more than a mystery box. And that, yeah, this is a 750 box, guys. So there's four still available. I'm going to head off now. Can you give me a peek of the orange box and start opening them? Um, I think another one just sold. So I think there's three available now. Um, show the items as an example, okay? I'm gonna show the other items. Kyan, do you want me to show the other Sabrina's saying to show them? Do you want me to show you them as another example? Um, that was the ladies. Yeah, I think just one just sold. So there's now actually three left. So I think that um, Chanel wallet did tempt on you guys because it shows what's inside of them. It's absolutely insane. Should I open the rest? Okay, there we go. I'm gonna do it. So, Kyan, I'm gonna show you what's inside. So, in this little Hermes box, we do have. <gasps> A little mug. How cute is this? I've got a mosaic mug in here. I hope you want me to do this, Kaya. You did say you didn't want it as a mystery, so you got a mosaic mug in there. What else have we got? We've also got, let me just show you. Here you go. We've also got, ooh, we have got a little universal lip liner, Hermes as well. We have got a little twilly cayenne this is the twilly you got how cute is this the little horse is all over this is so cute a little twilly any of your bags i don't i don't know what bags you have in your collection but the twilly is always a great idea and then we have also got another little box which is oh a little mosaic tray to go with your mug these are so good i love the mosaic ones this one and then the last piece is another Hermes box. So inside, ooh, a scarf. You have got a scarf, Kayan. So let me show you it. This is beautiful. Look all the colors on this, absolutely insane. So you have got a silk scarf as well, Kayan. So guys, this is what you're up for if you do get the boxes. All, obviously all of them are different and they're all complete mysteries. But Kyan, I hope you are happy with what is inside of yours. I mean, the Chanel cardboard is absolutely insane. I love it. Um, so guys, those are the boxes. There's now three left. I'm headed to Hanover. I'll just grab those now. They'll still be available. But I'm going to head off now as Singapore is going live. Oh my God, I just missed loads of comments. The keyboard sold. Oh, the keyboard sold. Congratulations, King. I think it was you. Sorry, guys. I just missed all of your comments. Oh, but Kyan, I'm so glad you're happy. Yeah, the scarf is insane. It's a double-sided scarf. Yeah, it is. You need all the boxes well you could get all the boxes because they're all different so all of them are different mysteries you're going to get different stuff um so you just never know way more expensive in the store way more okay congratulations kinga i'm gonna head off there's three boxes left um they're all equivalent to the one i've just shown in terms of like the value but they'll all be different stuff so it's a mystery i think it's a really just nice idea for gifting for christmas for yourself it's just really lovely so i'm gonna head off now guys but stay on the line to watch singapore go live now and um, I will see you soon. Thank you all for watching. Have a nice day.